was a full Friday request for Lay of the Land. Okay, so on the guitar, I'm starting with just this three notes intro that's played a few times. It's just E, open E, to F sharp, to G, open two and three on the E string with lots of distortion and some feedback coming in. Okay, and then we've got the uh, kind of next section where I'm playing uh, just an E chord for the verse. Just, just keeping an E chord chugging away for the whole thing. Okay, and then on the kind of chorusy bit, we've got I'm playing E to a G5. Okay, so that's three, not playing the A string, open D, open G, three and three. Then I play the D9, well a D suspended second I should say. Uh, so that's D, A on two, D on three and an open E. You can just hear, I think that open E's in there. So an A suspended second, again I can just hear a kind of B in there. So, gives it a nice little edge to the chord. So, I'm playing open A, 2, 2, open B, open E. So, so we've got... I think on the second time, it just stays on that D suspended second. Okay, um, I think it only does it on the first time it plays that, the rest of the time it goes to that. And then again, two more of those. Back into. Okay, so that's the basic guitar part. There's a few more overdubs and stuff later, but that's the basics. And next we'll take a look at the bass. It's a great bass line from Stephen Hanley that really makes this song. And I'm starting with E, F, G, A. So 9, 10, 12, 14 on the G string. And I'm just doing a couple of hammers from G sharp to A, 13 to 14, then two Gs on 12. And then the main bass line, the first one I did a slide, I think it, I think it might slide, it's hard to tell. I put E to G, E to A. So 14 to 12, 14 to 14 on the D and G strings. And, and then the rest of the time, I'm keeping that going with a little hammer from D to E, 12 to 14 on the D string, to G, E to A. And then just coming down, E, D, B, A, 14, 12, 14, 12 on the uh, D and A strings. And then, then it just sort of stops. And then I've got, I'm playing E, E, G, E. So 12, 10, 12 on the E and uh, A strings. And then a D to an A, a little slide down on the A. So 12, 12 with a slide. And the second time, I think it goes down to an E, that bottom note. Although if you played an A, you'd still get away with it, it still fits, you know. So 12 to 12, but this time the bottom note on the E string. Okay, and I think that only does that the first time when it goes to that section, yeah. And then back to um, D, A, and the, th the fourth time, you play D, A, D, 12, 12, 12. And then you're back into So you've got a longer walk down this time, and this is the bit I like the best, where it goes. You've got the 
these unusual notes to finish it off, which really work. Okay, so I'm going just the same as before. E, D, B, A, G, F, E flat, D. Okay, so I'm going 14, 12 on D, 14, 12, 10 on A, 13, 11, 10. And that note holds just a little bit longer than you think because it doesn't come in with, it comes in on that G note. So you, then you're back into what we played before. I'll, I'll be like that. Okay, and then we've got. And the riff changes to this later. You, you can kind of hear on the playthrough where it changes. We've got E, D, A, D, E, A, E, A. I'll play 14, 12 of the D string. 14, 12 on the G and D strings. And then 14 and 12 on the D and A strings. So an E to an A. Yeah, back into that. Okay. So that's the uh, main bass lines and guitar parts. So once you've learned those, you can have a jam along and enjoy your fall Friday. Thanks for watching, buddies.